just left recoil. Uh, they got a, today was the first time, no, second time. They didn't call me in, it was fucking great. I'm just so busy, I don't need to be unloading containers anymore. So I, I'm moving up, guys. Um, uh, I did need to pick up some stuff today for a couple of orders, and um, I was just checking to see what they had come in new. Um, they have a, a nice, good supply of the PX, um, PX65.4, uh, which is their new, like, high-performance Neo PA driver. I don't, I don't really recommend them for motorcycle, um, just because I don't think they're weatherproof. I think they just use a um, paper cone. Uh, I don't know why they made that choice. It would have been better if they used like um, aluminum or poly. I, I would prefer aluminum just for a little bit better power handling because uh, it sinks away some of the <clears throat> some of the heat. Um, they did get a refill in on the um, RED 1800.1. Those I, I never even did uh, the review on that one. I'll have to do a review on that one. It was just kind of an in-between uh, amp. It's basically a 2000 watt amp. They call it an 1800. Um, it's one ohm stable, uh, uses a 200 amp fuse, and um, it's like $200. So it's 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 kind of in between the 2500.1 and the 1200.1. Uh, but um, uh, we got there. There's a new supply of them in, and if you need them, I can get them to you for $200 shipped. And then what I do is I include a uh, zero gauge fuse holder. Oh, they got the, the ones that I like in. They're, um, I think they're, I want to say they're brass. Um, it's a zero gauge uh, fuse holder that uh, does either uh, full size a and L or um, mini a and L. Um, and they sell them in a two pack. It's some, it's some weird part number. I'll get you the part number though. Uh, but I'm, I told them to import those because again, some of the amps like the RED amps um, on the 1800.1 and then the 2500.1 and then also some of the other DII amps like the DII 3300.1 uh, that one does not have a fuse on it so you got to have an external fuse and they don't include it so you need to be able to buy it somewhere and it's just it's nice to get something that's matching I know I hear you but um, let's see those uh, they got a refill um, it's only like half a pallet but at least it's something they got the uh, RED 1800.5s that you guys love, and those are probably gonna be right around 265. So um, the dealers have been waiting on those for a long time, and I can't sell at the discounted prices like I did before. So it's gotta, the MAP on that is 265. So we're gonna have to use that. And that's, yeah, especially when you compare it to the JP version, um, it's, 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 a, it's, a good, it's a good deal. And then on that one, I include a 250 amp uh, uh, A&L fuse holder, this is a zero gauge fuse holder uh, with a 250 amp fuse. But I think that's it. I got a shipment that is going to AD ATV stereo today. And then I got a bunch of uh, extra goodies they gave me that were returns. And so I always like to throw those in for you guys. Um, I think that was it. Yeah, so today's only Tuesday. I got my tax thing tomorrow. Uh, to talk to my um, accountant and then we'll have a better idea of uh, where we can go from there but yeah if you need any recoil stuff just let me know and uh, we'll get you hooked up thanks guys